don't touch anything. <laughs> it's the greatest find yet. Nothing compares to it. But it's definitely something you should hear. This is The Real Deal with Larry Lawton. Welcome to The Real Deal with me, Larry Lawton. We got a great show here today. This is a recap from last Monday. Yes, Nicholas Tuesday. and I. Oh, last Tuesday. Yeah, we these go out on Tuesday. Sorry about that. We uh, had an argument about social media, and I decided to really, as I said in the last podcast, I have brought in a 16-year-old, a 42-year-old. We got Nick, who's 26, and I am 41. So we will now I am 62. So we're going to have a great conversation. I wanted to get rid of this, but Nick never did. Oh. So anyway, no. See uh, how everything just ruins the podcast. No, don't ruin anything, it's Nick. Just like the thing. He thinks I got. Uh, he thinks I'm autistic. A little. <laughs> a little. A little. I'm bit. sure I am. ADHD. Uh, probably am. Anyway, everybody, you guys hear us talking NFL all the time. My brother Dave, Paul, we're arguing all the time. And you know why we argue? Because we all bet. And who do we use? We use mybookie.ag. Yes, we do. Mybookie.ag, one of my new sponsors. They will give a guarantee on a deposit. Yes, you get a 50% guarantee extra money. Just use Lawton as the promo code. Yes, go to their website mybookie.ag put in Lawton as the promo code and if you put $100 you get $150 to bet with you can't beat that everybody you put in 200 bucks yes you get a 50% you get $300 to play with why not do it you got the Dylan Dennis versus Logan Paul fight this Saturday yes tomorrow you got Dylan Dennis Logan Paul I talk about this fight all the time check it out Go there, mybookie.ag, use promo code Lawton and get a 50% deposit match. Everybody, you have major prop bets you can use. You can bet the Super Bowl right now, 38,001. 38,001 on the Eagles. Go check them out. You can bet live. That's a big thing. In the middle of the game, you like something, go bet it live, and you get a 50% guarantee match. Can't beat that. Go check out all the prop bets, live bets, fight bets, everything else have a good day <laughs> and then this show is on social media and i happen to be a believer in positive social media and we're going to be talking about that here in the middle i'm going to introduce my guests first before nick chimes in first of all i have with me a really good kid jameson and you can't miss his name because we i drink jameson but it's spelled with a y jameson thank you for coming on you're 16 years old yep. What school do you go to? I uh, go to Melbourne High. Mel High. Uh, do you play sports? Do you do anything? What do you do? Yeah, I play football and baseball. I mean, you're a big kid, so you should be able to be playing sports. Uh, you good? I'm all right. I'm a pitcher. And I play third. Oh, you're a pitcher? Yeah. Wow, my brother was a great pitcher. Uh, and you play third in baseball. What do you do in football? Uh, I'm a linebacker, and I was a D end. Really? Good yeah. for you. And you're 16 only. Uh, what grade? Sophomore? Yep. Wow, that's pretty good. So you're going to be really playing on the team uh, next year? You just yeah. moved here, didn't you? Yeah, I did. Where'd you move from? Uh, Ohio. Ohio? Yeah. That was in Ohio. Where's that? It's a flyover state, as I call it. Not much in Ohio. <laughs> so you happy to be here? Florida? You like Florida? I do. Wow, Florida's pretty cool, isn't it? It is. Our next young person on the show is Nick. Thanks. Nick, how old are you, Nick? I'm 26. Nick is 26. 26. You're originally from... Uh, St. Louis, Missouri. St. Louis, Missouri. From the city? Uh, from the city, yeah. Call that a city. Okay, Nick is from See the city. I knew I was getting set up. People knew. People <laughs> it's knew. like he's got five jokes in his bag. Well, <laughs> people know uh, Nick from the show. Nick is our producer. He does a good job. Uh, he might be wrong on a lot of topics, but he does a good job. Anyway, next guest we have is Paul, my nephew, who is 42 years old. Paul is from? It can speak into the mics, oh. right? Should it, my, Originally from oh. Iowa. Yeah. Arizona, D.C., yeah. and now Florida. So. Wow, well, so you've been around. You've been traveling around. Paul, Paul, you are obviously, you're 43. 43, actually. You're 43 years old. You uh, obviously grew up a little bit different than me as, as a 62-year-old. But you, you grew up, I guess, just really experiencing social media start and everything else like that. Correct? Yeah. Yeah. When so, it first came out, right? And do you have kids? You have young kids, too. I do. We're going to talk about kids with you. We're going to talk about stepkids, kids, all that kind of stuff. You're also a, a 
Well, I mean, an accomplished young guy, you're a college educated man, you were accepted to the Air Force Academy, you were accepted. Naval. Naval Academy. And, and one other academy. Well, the Air Force, I had a choice, yes. Had a yeah. choice to go to Air Force. That alone, people, is impressive. I was a Coast Guardsman, uh, but not an academy. They didn't think I was college material. No, they did. Uh, so, anyway, yeah, down. Just down. Got it. Yeah. So, anyway, you can put yours to you. So anyway, uh, so Paul is here also. So what I wanted to do, everybody out there, is I wanted to get, is, is this good with me, Paul? I just guess so it seems off. Uh, it, it wanted to get with me. Yeah, that's good. It wanted to get with me to be, uh, I wanted to do this podcast and get the perspective from a 16, 26-year-old, 43-year-old, and a 62-year-old man. It's a good spectrum. Yeah, you know, I think people You're need to hear. like one, that's for sure today. I am I dressed like out. I can't be yeah, anywhere with my hoodie on. <laughs> man, T Grizzly, my man. Can't be in state with a hoodie on. Ah, ha. I love that's what it. he does. The the end of, ha. I love T Grizzly. Okay, <laughs> here we're going to go. Now, our podcast is going to be. You, look like you need to be in uh, uh, LA. <laughs> Well, this is this. Listen, I'm the young one at the table. That's how or uh, on the our strip. argument, everybody, last the week. The Vegas Strip. <laughs> oh wow, that was funny. <laughs> our argument last week, everybody, was if you heard the show, was does social media bring kids to crime, or does social media prevent crime? Now, we had two different opinions, uh, and I just think you're so loud. I just think that Nick did not understand what I meant. He's trying to say so there are only X understand. amount of stations Larry. like mine. Yes. And there's not enough that help kids prevent themselves to go down crime. But listen, you know? Taylor, Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift doesn't count. Let's stop bringing not? that bitch well, she's, up, she's dude. She's like number one on social Jesus media. Jesus Christ. But, but the, she's not advocating for better, like don't go to prison because I went to prison. It's not the same niche. That's yes, what I'm but talking about. let me ask you. We're talking if about he the brings JDs. up any YNW Melly, okay. he doesn't promote and say, let's go to prison, go do bank robberies. It's glorifying it, which falls down the But she glorifies the good. She doesn't know. She glorifies dating. And, <laughs> and what's wrong with that? She glorifies being on a jet, <laughs> it's just being a singer, being a positive niche. role you're model. Reaching your pit, your Think of what I'm saying. She glorifies good things, women's rights, being strong. You know, Absolutely. There's good things okay, Can you that. take your hoodie off? <laughs> Can't be anywhere with my hoodie on, see? <laughs> so and, and what I'm getting at was, is, Paul, you got what I was saying. Yeah. Uh, but you didn't get any of what I'm saying. Go ahead. None what we you saying? None of it. What? You don't even know what SoundCloud is. You don't know the generation. SoundCloud's you a don't music know platform. How actually toxic it was for drug use and overdoses. And but Nick, a lot but of you things don't, are toxic. You didn't even do research. You didn't even care to do research on any of it. You but, don't care is the thing. You didn't do any research on it. How do you know what I did? You didn't. Do you, do you sleep with me look, at night? I'll go look at your history. Oh, and, and you'll be surprised what you see in my history. <laughs> yeah, and it's so, not going to be any of that. So my my, my point to you, you is, basically were like, so what? That doesn't. That's you, not part you, of my miss, argument. See, guys, I want to ask your perspective here because first of all, it's not about does it promote or things promote. Of course, there are things promote. Media loves negativity. Uh, people like are drawn to a car crash, like in a race. If you go to Daytona, people go there to watch the wreck. You know, you go to a motorcycle race, you want to see the guy flip off his bike and go flying. Sadly. I'm not knocking that there are places that promote bad. But there's so there's more many places. more that promote good. No. It's, you're not looking for them. I, you just are saying that. What gives you the right to tell me? What that, tell, tell me what does, what promotes bad? I'll algorithm, tell you something. Algorithm alone, dude. Just whole, entire algorithm. I disagree. There's way more negative TikTok challenges than there are positive TikTok oh, stop. challenges. Like. I gave you the biggest TikTok. I gave you the biggest challenge on social media, ice which was the ice bucket which challenge, is no more. which it's, raised more money for MLS than anymore. any other thing. It's not bigger than the negative challenges. Absolutely. <laughs> Name me one challenge that was bigger. <laughs> Okay, but the can ice, you pull you the around? The bucket challenge has been dead uh, for yeah, that's years. Been I didn't dude. say it. For I years. said name been, there. There has been bad things from social media, like the podcast challenge and things like that, with kids trying to do, uh, or the chip challenge, where a person actually you know went to the hospital or died. I mean, those 
those type of things can be negative events, but I don't know if it's necessarily being promoted. The, 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 it's the, not. Uh, no algorithm is promoting it, Paul, the because I get shut down if I promote but it. The milk crate shutting challenge. shutting it down, right? So there's no control. Well, Remember what's what do you mean it's not shutting it down? The, the milk crate challenge? Yes. Where yes. people are breaking okay, so, their arms no, and their legs. You guys, okay. you're saying that these channels promote it. The algorithm promotes it. They let it happen. Okay, give me. I need I more. Promoting. I need more specific of what. What promote what? The negative aspect of what? He says the algorithm promotes negative. I don't see that. Okay, so they shut me down. Nah, so okay, so yeah, they do promote negative, but they're not gonna. You're not gonna they're see that it's door. negative. Like they're like with the milk crate challenge. How many people fell and got hurt? You know what I A mean. A lot of people. So many people. Yeah. And, like, not enough to not justify raising. Okay. All right. Hundreds of millions of dollars. Screw, screw the milk, cha- milk crate challenge. Look at like, the. do you remember the devious licks on yes. all over TikTok? Okay, so there are rappers. Oh, in, it's like, uh, what's his face? Boon B- yes, Bo- 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 Gang. Gang. Okay, yeah, I'll that, give you a perfect example. John, John Gabbana, Boon Gang. He, uh, 2016, he was blowing up for going into stores, like just taking shit wow. off the shelves. I can't like, believe I didn't think about that. He would grab that. whatever the fuck... Whatever he wanted. It's called the Boom Gang yeah, Challenge. Yeah, the Boom Gang Challenge. And he would rob stores, run out. He would say Boom Gang. And all over his Instagram, that's what he was promoting. And kids were going to school doing like stealing stuff off the teacher's desk. They were going to schools, like gas that. stations, Targets, Walmarts. And so I'm not saying you're not true. Right. But how but is that the, the biggest? Pro- how is that and the that was stuff? way bigger than the, the, the ALS how Challenge. Is that, for how is sure, that? No, maybe. it's not. It made Supreme Patty the way he is. Supreme Patty Nick, now has. you cannot say it's bigger than it. You don't even know what we're talking about, though. Supreme Patty is an. That's exactly why. If I knew about it, then I might call it bigger. <laughs> yeah, but something comes down to character of the kids and how they were parented. Go okay. into the thing. I mean, no, you, have, you have to say... Speak into the thing, buddy. It, listen, if, if, if certain kids are doing that, yes, yeah, some will. But if you've ingrained your kid good character, they can watch whatever the hell they want. And right. they will. There's no way... You can, put, you can put checks and balances on their social media... And you can limit what they see, but they're going to go somewhere and see it. Right? Oh, so kids are going to do gonna what they it. want to do. So at the end sure. of the day, he's not arguing that. But at the end of the day, there's got to there's got to be a way to put a little blame back on parenting. No, there a has, lot. There has to be. Not That's got to be because what you instill in your kids, not a lot they're going to think twice about doing these challenges. Those that haven't had that instilled with them, yeah, they're going to go out and do dumb things. Or Period. if you instill too much, they're going to be like, I'm going to do this fucking That's that. true. That's, That's true. absolutely true. Listen, Listen Nick, we're not here to talk about parent. We're talking about social media having yeah. an influence. There is a lot of positive, is what I'm saying, with social media. Yeah, and like, there's a lot of, okay, but like, like Paul said, I mean, no matter what type of parent, like, no matter what you see, if you are a well-minded individual, like, I mean, you... You know, if you're of age, you know what's right, you know what's wrong, you know what's smart, you know what's dumb. So, like, if you're going to continue to go do this stupid shit that could get you hurt, I mean, then that's on you. I I wouldn't really say social media, I mean, it does push it, but, like, at the same time, like, are you going to give it I agree, but what it does is it pushes good, too. It does, right. So, you you can't just say... It pushes good, but... It's the popularity the, 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 that I think like causes everything. them to do these things. It's like anything yeah. else. Yeah. There's and good and bad. bad. Good popularity. They want to be famous. Yeah. They, want to, they want, want to be famous. Viral, right? You want to be famous for running inside of a store and stealing as much but as you can. But some people want to be famous because you're a good singer some. and they learn that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, more more saying, than you some. know, Nick. It just depends how you it's use it. It's way easier to get views if you run into a store and grab as much shit as you can. I won't argue that. Then work really hard at a music career. Well, let me explain something. Nick said that social media promoted bad than they more than they promote good, and I disagree with that. It promotes more good. Whether people use it or not is different. I am not even allowed to say certain curse words or certain but words I'm not, not even going to say here anymore. Cussing is right. not the point. It's not the right. cussing. Yeah. It's even the but word. Listen, but listen to this, okay? So I, I agree with Nick that it does pu- push more negative because, listen, all the music that I was just, is pushed up... Look at Cardi B and all those girls. All of those what's girls... What's wrong with Cardi B? She's my alumni. Okay, but listen. Went to the same school as her. All the, but she went to We me. got young girls, 12, 13-year-olds that are like being like worshipped to be a thought and to do thought things. You know what, what I mean? No, no, like, no. You better explain that to my audience. Okay, so what I mean, like, <laughs> they, need they push a negative yeah, I do. agenda. You, you know what I mean? I, like, yeah. They push a negative huh? agenda. I need it. Yeah. You need, he needs explaining. A thought so is explain a hoe. A yeah, thought is a hoe. What? It's a hoe, Larry. A thought is a hoe. A thought. A thought? Thought. Equals hoe. A thought. Thought. T-H-O-T. Okay, a thought's a hoe. So what what about a hoe? So what I'm saying is, like, not even just Cardi, like, the negative that 
is pushed upon the music, the kids, you know, they listen to this music and then they think, oh, it's a cool thing to go do this. Being in a go gang. Rock. Yeah. Going to buy yeah, a stolen a lot of gun to have a gun on me when I don't be- need one. 100%. Let's just take that out of the equation for one second. Okay. And I'm going to put something that I don't even like, but I'm going to promote on this minute right. to show you the good. Okay. Do you know how many positive stations are pushing Christian music? Okay. A no, zillion. I don't. Oh, yes. I've never seen I that. will show you. Yeah. That so we don't. We might not go there, right. but there are a lot and of Christian views. kids who do. Okay. And they promote mm. that and they... I don't think Christian kids are outweighing NBA young boy fans. Yes, but I isn't really it don't think so? You like. no I'll way. tell you why you're wrong. Who's the biggest singer on the internet? Uh, Taylor Swift. Okay, Wait, is that is good or bad? Christian. She's promoting good. Yeah. She's, She's not promoting the thing bad. Is correct. Preventing right. crime. Well, yeah. I didn't say and prevent. then promoting crime if, are two different things. Listen, Nick. By preve- by promoting good, no, you in I'm essence not. prevent bad. If I steer you towards something good, that's preventing bad, yeah, correct? This, this all started with the, the there aren't enough Larry something. Lawton channels on the internet. Not like no, Taylor we're not Swift saying and Larry that. Lawton of course, there's the only X content. amount of X con who change their life. Doesn't a person right. control what they're going to see by liking and how many things time they're spending Thank on you. a reel? And so how somewhat, does that, that's not somewhat. promoting. They're using an algorithm Just based on what you like to watch. Somewhat. And who, and who got the most? Taylor I don't Swift. see Taylor Swift anywhere on social media. You don't? <laughs> no, not no. Come on, really. Nick. She I got see, fifty-four point. M- you don't see five either, million Larry. people no, on you Instagram. Can't go, social media. And she's you all can't, over it. You can't scroll through your Instagram. How about? How, hey, wait. How about? But you how about might the not Kardashians? Like oh, the Kardashians. Yeah. Okay. They promote them? good. Oh, I mean. Yeah, they say do. They're not saying and they help people get out of prison. They did a lot of good she stuff. Does. And you know how and many views they get? And guess what? Let's go there. Kim Kardashian's prison reform shit gets no views. Nobody oh, cares really? about that. No one cares about it. They all talk shit no on views. her for we're it. Gonna talk, we're going to talk to Nick's no views. I Trust mean, there's, me. there's mental She's, health things on Her the, makeup on sells way media. more there's than... There's a lot of good stuff on Her social. makeup sells way more than any lawyer stuff she does. That's yeah. for sure. Well, products are going to sell. Yeah, like, I mean... People know her for her skims and her makeup. No, And people Nick. really don't See, care about it. all you're doing reform. is you're, you're cherry picking. You're cherry picking, Larry. You, you are literally Nick, cherry picking. You know, I'm so glad you're here, Paul. You don't know about the boom gang phase. You don't what is know that? about and the, me not knowing. Has, no, you don't know about Cardi B promoting good. You don't know about what Kim you Kardashian. Saying? You don't know about you're Taylor Swift. You're literally just saying things, though. Oh, at no, this I'm point, not. you are. Nick, you <laughs> know. Do you know what he just said? Yes. Did you take any context of what he? Let just me said? ask you a question. What right. you what, don't know what, about what, Cardi what, B? Hold on. What Paul said was the best thing I could ever thought of. Doesn't likes, doesn't hearts or likes, whatever they or comments, mm-hmm. push algorithms. We know they do. As a YouTuber, right. I know they do. Nick does. Mm-hmm. Who has the most, good or bad? You want to take every rapper against every Cardi B, uh, I mean, every Kardashian, every uh, Taylor Swift, every good Well, there's only person. one Taylor Swift, and every rapper, if you combine all their total views and likes and pushing, is definitely going to uh, out- outweigh her. Oh, a one, yes, but now let me add Taylor Swift. Let me ask Car. I'll tell you what, I'll take Kardashians, just the Kardashian family, and Taylor Swift, and she'll outdo all the rap. But we're just that. We're just getting. Well, off, you're like, talking about. I could positive. even. I could just help you out, like Adele. You know, I can keep going. Exactly. You know, but I guarantee you that the kids <laughs> listening to no, some kids are oh, Nick. But watching something doesn't promote you necessarily. Right. Yes, it, it does. No, it no. totally does. No, no it yes. Does. If you're I've literally, looking I've at literally things, witnessed. If you want a little push, that's different. A bunch of friends of mine. I've literally witnessed well, kids you were go gun. out and like get stolen guns because it was cool that they saw well, kids that's people waving that haven't around been guns. Good thank, thank you. Haven't been in a good environment. Yeah, okay, haven't had a good. And there are a lot more people out here that are in a shitty environment. Look at this. People. One at a time, guys. No, no listen. Go ahead. Like, like you just said, people with not so good, good of parents view. or a shitty childhood, yeah. you know, they're not going to have the structure of facing the consequences at home. So, agree. And I mean, in certain, 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 certain case scenarios, you know, like, like Nick said, like with that whole boot, boot gang is a very good, de- uh, fuck, like a example because he was in there doing it and there's kids like that videos are pushed online and like we got, the devious whole lick, like there was kids at school, like if you, like friends would make you do this and if you didn't, they like bully you and shit. You know what I mean? Like 
That's and their the parents trend. can afford anything yeah. they you want. Know and I, I mean? am not so, saying that's not that. There's right. no question. But no, when you saying, take your school, how many kids in your school? Like 3,800. 3,800 kids. Right. How many get arrested? What? Not not 38, not 20, not 2,000, not 1,000. Right, like 10%. 100, 100. 10%, yeah, let's 15, call it. What, less right. than that. Even the ones who get arrested, did they all get arrested because the social media pushed them there? No. No. They get rid of because their family, where they grew up, maybe their dad was in a the gang, their mom's in jail. Talking There's about a zillion they made a bad decision. It had nothing to do exactly. with Exactly, social, social media. media. You can't it might blame not it. have any. My argument was there's more good with. Nick actually said that last show, okay. oh, then I think they should shut social media down, but you can't. But what? I would. I never said that. Go no, back because, and look. Okay, Listen, I never I said mean, that. Social media is very positive You're because a lot of people are making exactly. businesses. Exactly, it's very and positive. And you Way can learn, more positive. You can learn a lot of shit in a lot I faster. I agree. On, I agree. You know what I mean? It's so not like, the argument. Like, yeah. like I'm saying, it's just how you use it in, in which direction. It, yeah. That's really what it is. It's can just, it persuade people to do things 100%? I can agree with Nick on right. that. There are so many negative challenges out there that literally promote negativity than there are sure. like home feeding homeless challenges yeah. you know and i don't think that's, that's social media they, 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 they'll take that's that not, money right yeah. back after they're done that's with the video that's yeah. not true what you just said nick there's not okay. more stuff promoted because social media is not doing that because they won't let you do that you know that they shut they shut they negative. shut you down man i am no, shut don't. down so quick no they don't listen i got shut down on tiktok for 10 no, here's days the best thing, for though, promoting Larry. a gambling channel. Here's the best thing, though. Did right, you know that, YouTube's algorithm takes music and actual content creation into different considerations? Yes. If you just showed a gun right here, you'd get flagged. But now but all somebody these, else... All these music creators can show guns, shoot... Yeah, because yes. it's art. Yeah. And that's what they can say the different F word. Just they can say you whatever they want to. Yeah, just because you see that, you yeah, see that why are you putting that into the negative context? Because I've lived it. Like, I've literally well, been listen, through it. Just because you were a thug. <laughs> I was a thug, too. <laughs> I don't not put people thug. into the thug life. He's not a thug. And that's the whole point. I've literally watched county kids come down and act like thugs because of literally because, because of, of social media yes, that they've consumed. I know. Just because of the social media that they're consuming. They now think that that is the cool thing to do. Right. And that they'll th- they'll gangbang and throw up signs There's when so they've many. never even talked to a gang member. But how's that different than seeing they'll that sell at the mall? How's that people? seeing they that at the mall? Or how about that seeing a kid in the, in the school in a movie with color or a, game or a king or in a movie? Anything. So You're blaming because social it's right media. Here. It's right here. And okay, but what I'm what he's social saying media is, is where, more positive. That's what where I'm saying. do those kids get it from? Like the kids that don't have to be street, the kids that don't have to act that type of way. Where else do they see that type of life from? How about where? TV? No one watches video TV. Games. That's what I'm Let's saying. Let's go right back to video shit. games. Let's go right Nobody, back to your thing. The video games now, okay, maybe GTA. That's the closest thing to a gang member video game that kids nowadays play. Everything else from a kid that does not have to be in the streets and act like a gang can member. Can really feel like they're part yeah. of the streets and so then go the, to the, the streets. They, they listen to the They'll music. They pack. see the videos on Instagram about hitting a lick, which is robbing somebody. I, yeah. I know what hitting a lick is. Okay, well, <laughs> I didn't know if your audience... So you know what I mean? Like, it's... Social media has a Pop part and to play with That's a big one to me. The Which Xanax one? phase, because of social media, Lose, be, and that's yeah. solely, you cannot argue with me, that Xanax overdoses cloud, went through the roof solely because Sip of social lean, media. double cup. Solely because of social media. Yes. It was the you coolest know, thing to do. I, I, and listen. kids who never even knew what that was. And now Perk now 30s. Are, perk 30s. You know, like everybody's so talking about. So why aren't about, people, why aren't parents, stop, if, it, if that's really that big of an issue, because the parents aren't part of those kids' life. Right. Thank you, Paul. Right. So no, they are. That's not no, social not. media's fault. That could be any person down the street being a bad influence. Once your on kid your, gets a on car, your once your kid family. gets a license, good luck. Well, he ain't a kid already. He should have got his values before well, that's that. That's it. You got it. In, in the who they ain't around, the culture they're around. I mean, it that's doesn't all matter a huge about part values of this. Once you've got a car and you want to try a little bit. Listen, of stuff, Nick, that's you know, like, choice making when you're old enough to drive and have a license. That's a whole different animal. That's what I'm ta- talking about the social media. Talking Does about. social media have I'm a big influence on a seven-year-old going? Well, I'm and talking about okay. I'm talking about a 22-year-old. Okay. Do, do I think social media has more of an impact on people? Twenty, all 21-year-olds out there, every 21-year-old on the planet, social media to me, and you got to prove me wrong, has a more positive influence on 21-year-olds not- than a negative one. I think we're yeah, talking about I mean, a few amount of people, and I'll use right. one example. Back in the day, they used to show streakers across the fields and games, and I right? 
<laughs> my brother did it during a game. They showed it on ESPN. What happens now during this? They immediately turn the cameras off and they don't glorify it because they don't want people to continue. So to a point, you have you do have a point that people see things and want to reenact it. But that's a few amount of people. I don't think we're talking How many mass. people really did it? Exactly. You're talking small amounts of people and we're focusing, I feel like, on a very small population that are easily influenced. And yes, they can we be can just change theory. the argument too, and I can be like, okay, I'm on your side. But the right. whole thing was the amount of people on the internet that sole content is literally to talk to you about preventing crime, and that is your content. Not singing about their love life. We're talking well, about see, people but, you, but prevent- preventing crime is not just a guy like me saying don't. Because I talk about partying, Nick. I talk about doing drugs. You talk about bad things you did. I talk about things bad things I did. I glorify that if you want to call it that. And you're calling me a positive station, don't I? Yeah, you're not so, and, But I am being also the talking but about the consequences of that. Right. Maybe you're not looking at the music that says, "Wait, at the end, don't do this." How many songs are out there? And there are a lot that promote that good. A lot, exactly. So we have so to take that in concept. If you want to just too. hone in on the negative, it's easy to do that because right. social media is so massive. But Paul really made the points. The logs, the everything shows you where people are, and also the small percentage. That's why I'm a big believer in social media. You're right. There's How no can, doubt. There's no doubt. Social media influences people. But I can't but say so it promotes negativity. Not, negativity. Paul, You're not budget, so does thing. everything. Yeah, like, I don't think it promotes <laughs> though negativity any more than it promotes positivity. I think it shows both sides, and you have to be a, a smart uh, enough the individual poor, to read both of them. Yeah, I'm. I'm Think of that. And then you might look at it because you like it for whatever right. reason, but you're not doing it. Right? Are you going out and buying a gun because these guys got guns? Right. He I hope not. <laughs> I know a lot of people who are literally stealing guns because of it. When you say a lot, Nick, a lot of What's people, a lot? dude, five well, people don't hit running, on Nick, okay? running through cars. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he's a just very that. You're just talking about how running, either your mother wasn't a mother, running through and didn't cars, help you. Running through cars is a very. I think trend. lost people can be easily influenced. You're 100 percent right. There are there are people out Great. there that can see something. Okay, and then and, be, and then I can just say, you know how many people are in poverty compared to people who have good parents. Well, way more. Way more. Being poor or rich doesn't make your parents good. <laughs> like, That's right. <laughs> it's it's I don't think that matters. You're just trying to make an argument. In fucked up situation. There's I think there are way more people that are there. Great, great parents, and they get their kids out I, of I think there are way You want to look at a lot of stars situations. that came from poor parents? A lot <laughs> of them. That's not what I was saying. I'm saying I think there are people, way more people that are in fucked up situations than good situations. I think Growing a lot up. of people are in fucked up situations. Well, no, no, no. That, you're just, that's a numbers game. I mean, you want to talk about the percentage of, of Americans who are in poverty compared to the... But that doesn't mean they'll be influenced. So that comes down to the person, the individual, and how how they look the way, at it. That's also not... The way you're influenced is I'm just saying it promotes. But if you hang around bad things all the time and see bad things all the time, and that's, that's your algorithm... Yeah, you have a higher chance, I'm sure, to eventually do something. And I, see it. Yes. I mean, of course, algorithms, what do they do? You keep watching some. I, it's funny. I went on a, a video. I don't know what video I went on. And all of a sudden, they keep popping up on my stuff because you went on this, 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 this video. And obviously, algorithms see what you liked or you did or you're hearted or whatever it is. Uh, so they go on that. So everybody out there, make sure you heart Larry Lawton. Anyway, <laughs> so my point in being that is negativity and and preventing crime or see i think nick got it wrong he says my channel yes my channel has negative in it but i promote good at the end or i try to make sure be, well i want to show people that people can make it after they've right. messed up in life but I, i'll go to the biggest taylor swift is showing that hard What's that lady is one of the taylor hardest swift, workers though. you will ever see i have see. no idea what taylor swift has to do with this because i'm just giving you a person Let's who start works talking hard about the, the well, soundcloud why are you focused era on just rap yeah why are you That's, focused on just rap, rappers because you're focused on just taylor swift dude. okay why are you focused on rappers? Because Why are we focused rap on Because rap is old? literally the most popular genre right now. No, it's not. It's There's a lot of sports oh, on social media. Come on, media. Nick. See, you're so... To you it is, because <laughs> no, you don't even not. understand what baseball is. This kid can throw a pitch. You, you don't even know what a first base is. baseball are two different fucking things, dude. Oh, he's trying to say rap is the biggest thing on the what internet, the and it's fuck? not. It's what he likes, so no. it's on the internet. I don't, well, I don't listen to rap anymore. Nick, do you get rap on your feed? 
I do, but most of mine's <sighs> older, right? right like M&M. So. I love music. I get a lot of music in my feed. I get a lot of sports in my feed. I get a lot of news stuff in my feed. I'll, I'll get that Xanax you know, era was fucked up. Fucked up a lot of people. He and he's he won't taking even, he won't one, even, he's just taking he one piece of him. genre and saying rap promotes. It, dude, he's saying many. rap promotes bad <laughs> social media. Is what he. So he's really saying that social media is all about rap, and it's no. not. It's no, totally it's not. absolutely it's, not. It's not. That's you're just now rap you know, can promote bad out. things, probably, <laughs> but it doesn't mean all so rappers can, wait a minute, are Paul, promoting it. Paul, so can rock and roll. Co- correct. So Think can country AC/DC. music. That back in the day, those lyrics, if you listen to them today, they would be able to absolutely, like today, absolutely. So. Come on, hey, Martin. <laughs> yes, come on. So and so can so could everything promote promote bad. Everything can promote bad. Yep. We have to understand that. So uh, you know. Uh, what people don't understand is, especially with Nick, he's just taking the bad that he saw. And you're just saying, this is all you're saying. Taylor Swift. Taylor no, Swift has 40 that. billion oh, views. Say it for a Taylor Swift. Oh. That's all. Taylor Show Swift. around. Hey, That's Morty. all you're saying. Morty's good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Taylor Swift, the ice bucket challenge. That's well, all you're saying, is. dude. You could fix your car. So we're just veering off this Thank path, you very dude. much, Martin. There's, I'll I mean, talk to you before you go, buddy. There's mental health things on social media. It really comes down to what you're, you're focused on. What, yeah, but the thing like. is... Nick, Nick see, what he's doing, it. Paul, is he's just cherry-picking. Okay, you are cherry-picking, Larry, too. Are we still on the social media topic yeah. about yes. the negative? Yes, go ahead, tell me. I mean, personally, to wrap this topic up, I think, this is just my personal opinion, I think that there's really not a positive or a negative... I mean, in any aspect. It's just social like, media. It is, because, like, like it has positive, it has know, negative, just like anything. So, like... I can easily... I agree. We guys, agree there disagree. we go. I could shake your or fucking hand, too. Mutual. But the whole part, it's on the last podcast. It's on ChatGPT. The subject was promoting or literally channels that prevent... Like no, talking wait, is, is to it? you and preventing. <laughs> well, and Taylor I, I honestly Swift disagree does both not, I don't think it does either of those. Taylor Swift There's doesn't There's zero fall prevention because it's showing That's both like saying yeah. JD I agree. and Taylor Swift are the same type of content creators. I don't think there's zero. Nick is just so wrong on this because so people wrong. could go back and look you're, at it. You listened <laughs> so to last show, did you not? I did. Did you see what the show was about? I did. What was it about? It was whether the social media promotes or prevents good and bad behavior. So what is actually. When, I don't see where it promotes good or bad either preventing. way. Right. It shows both, but that doesn't... Just because you see something doesn't mean you're going to go do it. Right. That comes down to a totally different conversation, I think, on a person's character, their environment, who they're around. If I see something, I'm not going to go out and rip. Larry Rob Storrs told me all about it. Yeah, that sounds great. Had a lot of money. You think he's you know, going to it? Well, go do it. He's telling me enough. I go, no. I mean, he, well, he, he have prevents. enough to... That's the thing. He prevents... And there's does, not a well, lot of things out there. That she tells people prevents. how how he did it. How's that preventing someone from trying he to does, go do the same that's thing? That's his whole thing. He's, he's done his prevents bio. He prevents it by telling prevent. them. No, this is the prevention. <laughs> like, no, listen, though, this is the prevention. He talks about all the crrappy, shitty things that happened to him while he was in jail. All the things that he had to deal with, missing because time of with that. his family. So you know, the prevention is in the person's head. Listening to this is, oh, I better think twice about this. It was beautiful. Now it's not. I might get caught. I might not. I agree. That's a self. I totally agree. Self, and Taylor Swift is not doing you know, that. But neither is YNW Melly. Yes, he is. Why is he? Hey, does Taylor he's Swift promote it. getting a boyfriend and dumping him every month? Yes, yeah. she does it a lot. Yeah, yeah, she does. She I promotes don't think so. No, she, I'd say how? she promotes proactivity for sure. No. Yeah, yeah. See, and also, <laughs> see, YNW Melly. Tell to take him or yeah, any rapper. Any rapper. Sling that iron. When you, say prom- <laughs> when you say promote, I've never heard, and I've listened to his stuff, and I listened to T Grizzly, and I never heard T Grizzly say, go out and rob somebody. But glorifying go, it. Go out and do anything. Yeah. See, I, I, I would disagree either. because what? I've heard T Grizzly, so this is the okay. thing. They have. If you even in wind up, don't do song, that. You're don't literally intimidating. You have I'm intimidation not intimidating tactics. Him. Not you literally have intimidation tactics. Go ahead. Go ahead. Thank you. Go ahead. Intimidating you. Go ahead. Thank you. Keep going. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. That is intimidating. They all have young. They say youngins will go catch a body. They they have young people that'll go like 13 year olds in the hood that'll they'll pay them to go do illegal crime. So what I'm with the young people that is. Glorifying it with YNW Melly's, you know what I mean? That's where he's coming from. Listen, to glorify, listen, again, Paul said it right. 
I glorified robbing a Jewish store. I was a millionaire. You I had don't a limousine. glorify it, though. You oh, do sure not do. glorify well, he did it. about how great it was. I how much sure money do. He made. And then literally every single time you go, I went to prison. It was awful. Correct. Right. Was awful. That's the other side. Right. Other and that's side. preventing. <laughs> My point to you, Nick, when you said YNW Melly pro- promotes what? it, I've, I, oh, there's a zillion songs that promote good. Right. Country music. Zillions. Any music. Any music. So how can you say the internet promotes m- more or even good for that matter? You're right, right about that. It doesn't promote either. You're right. right. It promotes what it promotes and it, people are going to do it what they're going to do. Yeah. I mean, uh, you, it's the person listening to anything. Like Paul said, you receive it and now you choose. Like, you know what I mean? If you People hear, like drama. Gotta, yeah. So look at the news. They make money <laughs> on drama. That was it, Paul. Right? And Nick matter, loves so drama. Oh, yeah, that people great. like drama. And so, yes, they're going to be more drawn to that drama. Now, just because I see all that bad stuff happening doesn't mean I'm going to go do it. But if that's all you see in life and you've never heard the opposite side and you don't have those, those uh, characteristics built in you to make a good and bad decision... That's where you run into a problem. But I don't think you're talking about a mass amount of people for here. I think we're talking about a very small, uh, small being total <coughs> percentage. Right. I mean, totally I feel like cool. me and Nick here are talking about for our, you know, the younger crowd. No, so that's you, why it's smaller. Because like the, the, what's per, what's perceived for yeah, us is I the thought we were talking era, about because the Boom Gang us. era was all the younger kids, I'm, teenagers. Yeah, because I'm no, t- no, yes, and I get that. It just so I happens you do. got that, but how many kids didn't? Right. You're the looking at did, you. You're looking he's looking at him because he did. comes from the hood. How many kids got I think your environment was a bigger uh, his bigger environment was a bigger cause to him than anything absolutely. you saw <laughs> and listened heard. to. Totally. The but the same around. kids who were in the four million dollar houses in St. Charles literally were watching social media and coming down for fun getting stolen guns getting addicted to Xanax yeah. thinking that that's a cool lifestyle to live because they were literally watching it at home yeah but Nick that's a small percent how many didn't you tell Fair me one's <laughs> not you how many <laughs> listen I call. can tell you how many didn't if if the number of people incarcerated shows you it's a, it's only a small percentage very whether it's six percent, three percent, nine percent, whatever it is, it's very small. And social media that SoundCloud era ran through the suburbs and really fucked up some suburbs. Well, listen, I'm not We're saying not it didn't, but I'm not disagreeing. <laughs> it's the parents that weren't on top of their kids right. that really screwed no. them up, Paul. What do you mean no? How do you say no? You to should that? be able to know where your kids are. You're, what you see doing. What you're going to do stupid things, and I'm sure you have. Yeah. But your core thing is not going to do it. The core. Yeah, going to do... We all did stupid things. We all make Paul, mistakes. Every and day. I call them and say, I have a t-shirt I sell. I don't believe in bad kids. I believe in bad choices. Mm. Most kids make bad choices. Right. Now, the kids that went and let that SoundCloud influence, that's bad choices. Are they all bad kids? Did you know how many successful people I could show you that went to jail or right. made bad choices and now are billionaires? Absolutely. So it's that not like they're the bad pe- people. They're bad choices they're what, that turn their line. See, what do you make that sound old? Fifty? Well, just no, that, it that's just young. doesn't go with the argument, huh? It just doesn't go with the argument. It so you're does. Just cherry picking. How am I cherry picking? Who are these billionaires you're talking about? I'll tell you who. I, I bet I'll you, you they Steve didn't Jobs is one of them. <laughs> Steve Jobs. Exactly, dude. What he? What he get in trouble for? Steve Jobs was in, didn't shower, didn't smell. Was is that drunk. illegal? <laughs> is that well, illegal? Is it e- Listen, you want to talk about illegal? Is that illegal? Nothing's illegal if you don't get caught for it. Did he go to jail? <laughs> you want oh, Steve Jobs went to jail? Know. I don't know. His okay. All right. All right. <laughs> he's just he's, he's getting me no. You're off. just you're going back to the whole. Well, in the '60s. No, I'm not. Why topic. does he say the '60s? I don't think it matters the time. Influence in the sixties, they had bad influences. And Absolutely, in I had seventies. They had good. the mob was a bad. Media influence. has changed because you were around the mob and it now, influenced Social you. media might exactly. be gone. It's a whole other thing. Where, uh, you I'll know, right it's in your brain it. doing it. Who knows? You right? Exactly. They have something implanted. Who knows? Your like mom was a great mother, but you were around the mob. Okay, and it influenced you badly. Okay. Absolutely, you and she instilled good into you. Right, but okay. you know how many kids in my neighborhood didn't okay. go in the mob. 99 out of the 100? <laughs> Good chunk. I'm one of the bad guys. And I'm I'm okay with that. 
But when you got out, you didn't go back and do it again. Yeah, you see, listen, I so made you did my have point. something ingrained in there. It's like absolutely, I, made a bad I had I good things. I take care of my mother now. That's pretty good uh, 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 quality. But what Nick, I think Nick got the whole thing wrong by saying social media yeah. influences people bad. And if no, as could, soon as we started what, what arguing about it, it show. flipped to positivity. If it would have started about positivity versus negativity, there'd been never of an argument. But the sole argument I'm going back to are that there are channels like you, JD, Jess, compared to all of the negative shit out there that promotes You can't tell me a channel that promotes negativity. Dude, you still oh, don't think... Right. He, Criminal said, acts. he literally said that No Jumper doesn't promote gang violence. It does like not. gangs and you know no jumper? the street Adam. and popping Adam pills. Adam I've been on his show. Pills. Yeah. I've been in his studio. I've been with his whole staff. I didn't see where any one of them promoted it, anything negative. It literally, he... Every, of course, he has a gang every, guy on. A, one promoting? gang guy... Literally all of his co-hosts are gang members who glorify the gang life. Listen, they Larry. got out of it, Nick. No, they are still actively in the streets, Larry. That's a game. That's so just Larry. <laughs> Come on, dude. Shut he's up, out Paul. of jail. He's Shut in the up, streets. <laughs> like, what the hell? What up? See, he, he just, See, he just he got so out of whack with that thing by promote. not thinking about no how big social media promote. is. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? I no got, Jumper it, doesn't promote gang activity. Do What do you think no. about No Jumper? No jumper, all the guy. I mean, every say one person who promotes going to the gang, go join a gang. I watch jumper, no jumper, See, all that, the time. The word that's that's the issue here in this argument. Promoting word, versus recognition. Pro, the, this this or, word promoting because I promote man, but promoting making something, something look is cool. Like here, this water is very good. I want you to come drink it. I would say influencing would be a better word because it's 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 pushing that. It's glorifying it's cool. it. Or it's pushing that this is the way. It's okay. This gotcha. is you know what I mean. I wouldn't say promoting, but I would say influence. I would okay. say it has. A, it has. Do a I influence? influence? I influ What do I influence? People that stay you out influence? of prison. Yeah, that, that's your. Th you know, because you talk about all the shit that you did. And there's you talk not about enough you of going that. into prison. You talk about how you changed your life and what you did to do that. You know what I mean? So like, and I, now tell me one no jumper show okay. that. Influences gangs to go to a gang. Let's just turn a live stream on, yeah. Larry. Let's just turn I, a Austin live stream Ritchie, on. Uh, King Von Dirt, like all, okay. So if you really like Adam's podcast and all of and Adam's he knows Twitter's, exactly what he's doing. Yeah. So like his Twitter, it's it's all it's all rap beef. That's that's his Instagram. He rap beef now. Rap it beef. is. He's changed a yeah. little bit to yeah. go with he, this. He, he's all in the drama. He'll tweet like he'll tag. He'll be all buddy buddy with this one dude and start posting and dissing this one dude. So like I've seen his. You stuff, know what right? I mean? Yeah. So I feel like that does promote the gang violence because he. he, he I think he promotes drama. I don't drama. I don't think he promotes where to, to go to a gang. In, <laughs> okay. in fact, let me, let me the more you talk that. about that. You don't want to go to it. Let me rephrase that because mm. the other week, Adam posted a video. He said something about, you need to come put the guns down and give my boy a fade. Catch a fight. You know right. what I mean? He wanted to fight. Well, Adam's a lean. You know, he, he, he promotes all the drugs. He, and so, like, th that that life is definitely influenced on Adam. Adam was literally doing Xanax with a 16-year-old boy and having him yeah. Yeah, get grown woman to have sex with him. Yeah, Little he, pump. He when no did that happen? The During the SoundCloud phase, I can literally pull up videos. Go, Paul. I can literally pull up videos. Yes, I can pull up a vlog where Adam is like, oh, I just hooked up Little Pump with this grown woman. He's he in the back room hey, getting the fuck. That. No. Huh? No. What? There's a case other open right now. I it's talk still about having sex it. with people. You know how cool that is for a kid? <laughs> this is proven right now. It, it, Hold on, we got two guys. He was two feeding guys. kids oh, Xanax. Was this just, was just open like a couple <laughs> months ago. I saw it. It, it was open. It, Adam has a case from like 2009, 2011. Uh, oh, Adam 16. Having sex with a 13-year-old girl. <laughs> and that, that case is open now. We know about that because yeah. we watch another channel that, that talks about it all the time. Yeah. You know, we, we watch a lot of right. that. So, and we understand. But what Paul just said is so good. But does he promote to do that? Glorifying it is the he same thing. He never glorified that one that, that's bit. That's what I'm saying. The promote word. We can't well, even it. that. He yeah. has not no. influenced or even. What's the word in you fact, use for you would not want hey, to do Talking it. about right. something is not promotion. And not only that. Yeah. Listen to this, it Nick. It's, no. It's, it, no, it's well, not. No. What are you trying to do with your cigars? Like subtly promote that's them in the back? That's a He's selling those. No. He's promoting them to try. What's it called? Uh, He's thinking subliminal marketing. Okay. Subliminal messaging Sub is promoting. Subliminal but, but, messaging is in everything. Okay, but yeah. in everything. Can I ask you a question? Yes. 
If you're talking about Adam 22, yeah. if you heard what's going on with Adam 22, would you want to do that? Yeah. That's the subliminal message. Right. Yeah. That you but don't listen, want to do in, it. In that, so it's not promoting What, the rape again. case? Yes. I wouldn't want to go near a 16-year-old listening well, to this guy. Well, that's what we're talking about. We're talking about him. You talked about Adam taking, 22 and We're talking about him friend. taking two 16-year-olds on tour. Again. Feeding them Xanax and partying with 16-year-olds. No, I don't think I, he was when you vlog it, it, fact, when you vlog it, he's in trouble and, and it's all it. over the social media. But these were boys. These are not the. I don't think. I think you're a little confused. No, I'm not. I think it's all over social media. No, and what I'm talking about don't do it. Are two Am I right? Do you know about kids. it? About what? A little Adam, punk. 22. I know about it. Okay, so like yeah, what, you're on the. What I'm thing. getting at? Do you know how much trouble he's in? Do you know how much is on the internet? So you are on a different. It's all over social media, correct? That to See, me we're is, not talking about the same thing, Larry. You're talking about the girl 16-year-old? No, I'm just letting you know. I'm not arguing. You're talking about the girl 16-year-old Casey has. Yes. I am talking about him going on tour with two 16-year-old boys doing Xanax and partying for at least three months. Do you know about that? It was, it was, he doesn't even know about that. He's on all over him. Smoke perp. He doesn't yes, even know okay, about yes. it. It was Little Pump and now, Smoke Perp. Now perp. hearing about those, yes. Then those two are factual. They were 16 but years old when they were doing that. that yeah, but they're promoting. Crazy, but, I mean, Little that Pump was. and Smoke Perp, they were doing that on their own and way harder drugs before they met Adam. That's how they kind of popped up. Uh, I remember Gucci Gang. That's where Little Pump really blew he up. Knows. You know, yeah, he knows. I know. I, I could tell you the same thing. You just don't want to listen to me, dude. No, I'm listening to him. But that's like Paul. If you literally hung out with a 16-year-old kid and were doing Xanax with them, and a, don't film it, you're still promoting that for these kids. Either giving it to them or something, but if they're doing it on their own, just hanging out, I don't think and that's And you're doing no. it. How about Paul? Are you in trouble it? for something? No. Because no, you didn't promote it. Promote you know what I mean? <laughs> think yeah. about it. People try to help kids in you trouble get what I'm all the time. And they t- they accept these kids that are that are having problems. These guys are on drugs camera all the literally time. fucking swallowing. That doesn't mean you're promoting that. I mean, you know, choices... Choice. You, everybody has free will. You make your absolutely. Oh, for sure. You know I'm a believer yeah. in that. Uh, yeah, no, absolutely. big believer that in choice. Free will. And everybody, yeah. especially at your age, you're 16. If you do something in trouble, I ain't blaming Paul, people, your mother, or anybody. People ate I'm it looking up. at you and saying, "Hey, Jameson, you're a f- moron," yeah. <laughs> right. and that's it. I was nice with my word. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, because better. like at the age, you, you can are take smart. accountability. Yes. And, I mean, absolutely. Yes. Are you immature? Do I think you should be held accountable like an adult? No, because you're still learning. Right. And, and, and I'm okay with that. And so is Paul or anybody. Now, you will get to a point where it's, hey, now you're on your own. You got to do the right thing or you're out. And what he Nick was saying, again, going back to the whole basic of this. You're not because it's I changed. I still don't get his, his argument because social media to seen. me is more positive. Then it is. It's okay, not, that's not, not the positive. argument. It was it not positive. More good. If you're no, always watching positive. negative stuff, there's a higher chance you're going to do bad yeah. things. But, but it's, same, it's still not the, the, the because of your. I don't know if that necessarily means. Let him talk to one at a time, guys. Right. So what I'm saying is, somebody like you, you have, you know what I mean, the crooked diamond cigars, you have the lighters, you have shirts, you got a whole bunch of different shit. So social media is pushed for business aspects. Social media is pushed for learning things. And that's, that, that falls into a lot of your category. Most of the time you spend social media is all for your brand and business. Am I right? Yes. All, all and the I time. Mean, and not most. You're right. And if not, and then it's message. learning something. My message. Or something for a new video or content creation. So that all is positive to you because it benefits you and your business. But you know what some people say? What? I am pushing or promoting since I have a young audience cigars. It's smoking. Okay. Which, well, there's Some people will say that, but... There's studies out now. We'll go into that later. We're doing today. But my point is, uh, I never ever will say to a young kid, smoke cigars, right. even though I think it's okay. And there where you'll get some people who keep looking at me and say, well, I wouldn't want, he's a bad influence on my kid because he's always smoking a cigar online. He's doing this. Now, that's up to that parent, that up to the person and everybody else. I don't think social media is to blame in any of this. It e- would either be me, mm-hmm. it would be the parent who lets their right. kid watch me if that's what I wanted to do. Mm-hmm. It's not. So, he this, goes this, back to the SoundCloud area. No, but he goes is, out to the net. It really started, and I don't know. You guys will notice, and I'm going to ask this question. Nick said that the internet or YouTube, 10 years ago, you wouldn't remember. You were six, maybe. I don't know. What What, what year did you? I started you, watching YouTube. About ten years ago, I was seven. Wow! Uh, and you, that started you, do, we, do you remember no, YouTube? I was, when it started? I was ten. When I okay, started so watching. you've been around seven years. 
You've yeah. been around. You remember YouTube when it started? Yeah. But it was like help videos and stuff. Mostly. See? But it wasn't. See, we didn't but know But it that. wasn't. Guys. I didn't know that either. But it music, really was Music and help videos is what I remembered it most. Of. And he don't remember the band. That, all that stuff was on there for I'm sure. I'm not saying it wasn't yeah. what you said. Do you remember seven years ago? What was YouTube like? What did you watch on seven, seven years ago? Uh, so At 10 years old. When I first started watching YouTube, it was like music or like, you know, gaming videos. Like, Did you ever do a crime or do something, want to go somewhere because of a video you saw? I Be was, honest. Lighting shit on fire. I would watch videos. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I was like a little kid. I would light stuff on fire, Damn. like or little bombs, <laughs> stuff like that. You know, no, no serious crime or something like a ten year old could do. Just stupid just, stuff you shouldn't you do just in the house. Burn the house down. Yeah, damn. It. <laughs> <laughs> the microwave challenges. Yeah, so we were doing that. Yeah, when there was social media. You know, we were doing that when there was a social media. <laughs> but I get what you're saying, and right. that's what you watch. But your parents or whoever was there was yeah. enough to say. Listen, you go there, I'm going to beat your ass so yeah. bad, you, you're going to come home. And I get it. And that's where I think Paul made the best point of this show mm-hmm. was at what point do we just not even talk social media and say it's the parents or the people around the people. Listen, there's kids with no parents who make good choices. And where do they get their, their parenting from? Social media. Yeah. But they just happen to want to be a push towards positive people on, on social media or family or family or, family or me, or meaning like if you, if, if you had no parents, your parents was in jail, your dad's in jail, your mom's a, a whore uh, or dead or whatever, you know, your she's, mom's a whore. A thought. <laughs> a thought. A, what do you call it? A thought. A thought. Yeah. My, your mom's Very a thought, your that. dad's in jail and you happen to go on social media. Does that mean you're going to be sucked towards a, a, a bad? No, you might like something that's somebody positive. And all of a sudden, now you're, you're, you know, you don't want to go. Because everybody has a vision. I, my dream is my kids don't know, draw to my old past. I want them to draw to something good, you know, positive. And I think Nick knows how I am with that. I am, I like to party. People know that. I like to have a good time. I'm very independent. I believe in choice making. I believe in drugs. People can say, well, Larry, that's a bad influence. Yeah, it might be. But I also say, I don't believe in drugs for young kids. Mm. When you're 20, 21, I don't care what you do. Mm. My own daughter and I, she could not party around me or drink. Now, when she hit 21, I took her down to the key. She drank me under the table. So I know it wasn't <laughs> the first time she was drinking. But my point was, I told her when she came in that house, <laughs> you can't party, you can't do drugs, you can't do crap around here. Or none of your friends. And that's the end of that. She knew it. Now, did they? I don't know. I'm not going to push that end of it. My point is, <laughs> I I want, it's about. Dude, your chest hair is fucking distracting, bro. Why did you walk out here in that? In my hoodie? Because I can't have my hoodie on anyway. <laughs> no shirt. No shirt on. A hoodie on anyway. My, my. <laughs> I'm waiting for it to like, get caught in the zipper. Oh, shit, my hair. You, know? <laughs> I, 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 you know, really, uh, social media, to me, social media to me is a positive thing. It's very positive. And it's yes, needed. It should it never is. go. Yeah, you go, said I, yesterday, I, I, and I will go back. I we will go. I and I want you. I learned how to tile and make money off of it. I got something It's a very you, positive Mr. Social place media. that is totally, He does yes, the editing. And dude, if he's honest with himself, and he's totally honest true. with this audience, what? he will go back to the show last week. Last and week. take the clip where he says on there. And I asked him, so you would want no social media. Well, if you could change it, yeah, but you can't. That's what he said. I never and I want him to go. Social I'm going to pull some clips he You're should take. I want you guys to watch. You heard the show, Paul. I did. No, my exact words were, I love social media. I know <laughs> you love it. That's all you know. <laughs> so why would I ever say I, I don't want it Because we were to be arguing around. about the negatives and positives of so or the... the and I the, personally... Don't give a fuck about how much negativity. No cursing. You yelled at me for cursing. <laughs> See that? You but should, I don't you use that, it repeatedly right? back to back. Is that because I'm on social back, media cursing? Why did you curse? Because I can. Uh, I don't use it out. I don't use He's it seven beating. times in a row. I don't need like the, you cannot. This is you cannot use the R word. You can't. You know use what the R word is? The right? FA it's word. Not, it's not safe. What's the FA word? You know oh, the, the different. Yeah. yeah, I call. I yeah. call the dog yeah, the bounty hunter. You can't use that. Those are yeah. <laughs> Used those to be are a cigarette. Those are day. those yes, are that's automatic. Exactly. Those wow, you always yourself. <laughs> those are automatic demonetizations right there. You can't argue about that. The you R, can say the S and the what? Those two right there. Just those two. Yeah, just those two. Uh, no, so there's something far, else. So far, you no. can say fuck. 
Now, what you do is you say the F word seven yeah. times in the span of literally 10 seconds, and then it gets picked up by the algorithm. Is that what the problem yeah. is? Just, You're a louder you dude see. when you talk. You be yelling it. <laughs> I, oh, me? And yeah. it's, every so other, scary for, it's <laughs> every other word for 10 <laughs> seconds. And I'm like, you just said it seven times in 10 seconds, dude. No, I do it. And then, that, then they get you on excessive. And that's what it is. It's excessive. Okay, so I could do it, but only occasionally. Yeah. Yeah, very occasionally, yes. They don't want me and to And now do you it, can't yeah. say it twice in one sentence, or else it's excessive, allegedly. You have nip slips? Apparently. <laughs> no, because <laughs> hey. he's about ready to have one. Like a <laughs> I, 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 listen, am I allowed to say the N word? I don't know. Oh, Is that it, one too. Yeah, yeah. Can you say the N word? Oh, nip, no, nip. nip. Yeah, you can say nip. Can I say I, the yeah, N word? Okay, so Come three on. of them. Can I say the N word? Nip. Nipple. Do not. <laughs> oh, I said, do not. What I was hell? talking about the racial one. <laughs> we'll Did you ever hear the girl? Tell them about the girl, uh, Dabbing Daddy. Uh, I don't want to bring that up. Why would okay. you do that? Yeah, that's crazy. That's just ruining I bridge. won't. I, just burning a bridge. Exactly. You know? so don't I won't. Up. Listen, people who know me know me. One, I'm not a racist. Mm. I am not a that's prejudiced what, person that's what at all. Say. I'm just kidding, guys. He's not a racist. <laughs> and any of you know that. I mean, I will have sex with any race, <laughs> any, <laughs> any any gender, any any gender, any race, you racist or anything not. except an animal, <laughs> <laughs> a Martian. Oh, uh, no, Jesus people Christ, people Christ. take. First of all, I love social media for the fact you're right. I promote my brand. I get out there. I have 1.5 million people on YouTube. I have uh, 400,000 or 500,000 on TikTok and this and all these numbers. And Nick and them will tell me, well, it's gone down because you did this or that. The other day I said, you know, I don't no, care. It did go down though. I know. And I said, what did I tell you? I don't give a crap. 4,000 in like a day. Because of why? Because I did so. Because of the nude podcast. Because of the nude podcast. He posted but his it was nudes fun. That was a good on show. Instagram. So you're losing followers because of the nude podcast? I did lose. I, you would think I would gain them, wouldn't you? I would no. think so. That yes. on your audience. Yeah. And what they, it depends audience did, on does. the audience. But I, listen, I think in the long run, I'll gain them. Yeah. I mean, if you went to a new niche, for sure, you'll gain new people. Yeah, uh, listen, sure. it, it is what it is. I I, I don't, I, don't I am who I am. I'm not going to change. Social media has, I, I think if you've tried to follow every single little of these of, of all these social medias, I mean, now TikTok won't do this, that. You can't do that. You have to just be who you are, be accepted for you. You know what I'm finding out? Nick and I look at this a lot. I want to be canceled in a way. What? Because every, you can't cancel me. You will you not watch me if I say anything or do certain things? No. You'll still watch yeah, me. I'll still watch when that's, then get, I'm not canceled. When people get canceled, you just get double the eyes on your channel. No, yeah, and the that, only that, thing that, that really cancels you is you stop making content. That's what yeah. stop cancels. If I quit now, if you make another account and you keep going, yeah. Oh, not no, even, oh, you're no. talking about canceling Look at me. How often. No, I'm talking about like, you know, people, we're talking about other YouTubers, we're talking about other oh, people oh, coming out saying, yeah, we're talking, oh, you're Larry, this, Larry, that. we're talking about Twitter canceled. You know, not yes. like the ban canceled. No, not ban when but he look at how shut often my channel. Alex Stern got canceled or taken right. off. That's what we're saying. Look at, yeah. look, and, he came oh, and that was our era. Than ever. And that's our yeah. era, Paul. You're right. 100% right. And he came right. back stronger. And I'm talking about like an Andrew Tate type canceled. Mm. Yeah. Or no, no, no. He got banned. No. No, nah, that was he a whole, actually got banned. Like Andrew Tate. That 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 situation was yeah. like everything. Like if you're hurting people, yeah, he like got you don't deserve, deserve shut down. Yeah. Now that's different. I'm talking. You know, like okay, I'll take Louis C.K. Do you know who he is? Uh, he almost canceled that's himself. That's the cancel He almost did, but <laughs> yeah. he came back. He came back, and he came back stronger than ever. You Over know, something so dumb. Oh, that, the jacking off one. Yeah. That was so stupid. But there's so many things that you... And what we're finding out, obviously, is the only one I can get canceled is if I say, oh, I feel bad, they said that, and I quit. Well, I'm not. Well, that's <laughs> so, like And, and shame, they're going to be people who don't shame. like me, so what? <laughs> Right. You know, I learned something wow. in life. You can't make everybody happy. That's like Shane Gillis's well, career. Turn, turn, off that turn off that episode. If you don't like it, right, don't turn it off. You know? Listen, it's people like, know who I am already. Shane Gillis's career literally took off after they tried canceling. Uh, it, it's, you know, I got 30 million watch hours. You know how much 30 million watch wow. hours is? There's only 8,000 hours in a whole year. 8,000 hours in a year. 24 Daddy hours Granny a day. kind of got canceled, though. Who? That did really affect did her. Did she? Who? It really did affect her numbers. Who? Gavin Granny. Who? 
dabbing oh, granny. She still got 1.4 million on, yeah, on Instagram. Yeah, but that doesn't matter. You see, like, all her interaction is not what it was. Yeah, I get it, she but she's still, getting, she's like still doing 7, commercials. 000. She's doing stuff. She used to be pulling, like, 7,000 well, per live. subscribers want to hear something, so they should tell. They should write. They should say, this and is now what it's we want like you to talk about. You know, 100. Voice yourself. I mean, if you want to hear more of you doing something, that's she the was whole messed point. Up. Be interactive. You know, I look at it like... There's so many things you have to worry about. When I, I, I 30 million hours watched, 30 million hours. That's a ton of hours when you think about it. No, that's a shit ton of hours. That's a lot that's of hours. There's only 8,000 in a year, Paul. One year is 8,000 hours, 8,000 something if you add it up. There's 368, 100, 168 three, whoa, 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 uh, hours in, in a week. You're messing, stop. You're doing a lot of math. In, in a what? You're doing a lot of math. Let's stop. Stop. Oh. Let's stop. Everything just shut off. What? Is it back on? Looks like it is. Not oh, show. it was my headset. Yeah, he's playing with his head. No, he does I mean, this all the No, time. this thing is all loose, dude. Just Everything's shut up. Yeah, 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 he had to show okay, his okay, power. Okay. You okay. saw that, everybody. Okay. I'll end it. Oh, I'll end it. He's, it. he's getting I'll cocky lately. Sound effects over you know what he says in the car the other day? He goes, yeah, I know what I'll do. See if that episode gets up. <laughs> <laughs> Son of a bitch. No, the... Uh, I look at that. So at, at, at the amount of hours in them, even even though I'm not on social media long mm. i'm a short timer i'm on social media a lot less than you i'm only on three years that's all i've been on social media three and a half years yeah his screen time is 12 hours though a day on his phone yeah oh uh, no it's not 12 hours you want me to tell you what it is it's only six hours <laughs> a day yeah it's 12 it's a lot you're even up 12 hours a day are you kidding me <laughs> My point to you <laughs> is I know who I am. I'm going to do. And social media doesn't influence me. Right. I don't think it influences you. I don't even think it influences you. No. I don't think it influences Nick. I don't think it influences anybody I know in that way that right. they're going to go do something. To, I hope I influence people to go buy a lighter. Yeah. <laughs> I hope I go influence people to do the right thing because it's a positive thing I'm doing. Now, if they don't, I can't change it. And, you know, and it's not everybody. It is a small percentage, one way or the other, that I can either a small percentage are going to buy a lighter or a small percentage are going to do the right thing or a bad thing. Mm -hmm. So I'm not thinking of social media in any way, but I think it, it, all I'm saying, it's more positive and it's more preventive than it is pushing people to do something bad. Because Paul had it right. And it's even on that topic is it's about the parents. It's about the people, the social place, the people you're around. I think that has more of an influence on anything. It's in a educational. Big way. There's good and bad education. coming. Nick, from. you told me you learned how to be a, a, a tile guy on the Internet. Yeah, but that's not the argument. So I'm yes, done. Is. I'm done, dude. I yeah, would, I would you, give you, you know, I would because I can yes, totally it, just it shake your hand and be like, things, oh, there's positive things. and that's negative stuff. But the whole thing started with the channels. No, it did and not. Suck. Yes, it did. Well, I literally just listen, read everybody out the there. ChatGBT if you're watching this show subject, or you're listening on Spotify, I just read the ChatGPT subject. I didn't and do anything. He, he, he exactly. can read anything he wants. <laughs> Go to the last it, show, yeah. everybody, on last Tuesday, and look or we'll listen to last show, and you will see exactly what the show is about. And Nick is going to apologize to me off air. No, I'm not. When I show him what that oh, last no. show is about. Okay. If you're a man, you even, will. You didn't even and watch stop it. being a, 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 a YouTube you influence guy. Watch it. Or don't be influenced by negative, Guys, not apologize. You didn't even watch the podcast. So. I watch. I do them. Why do I gotta watch them? <laughs> so exactly. So you. you I you remember them. They, you they, they, you, you do, know what kind of memory I got? Do not remember them. <laughs> I got a memory. For I sure. can tell you. Anyway, we're gonna hit that. You have any any topic, anything you want to talk about right now? You're a young man. You're in front of the people. You're obviously thank you for coming, but you, you got a uh, you, you you got a good future. You know you got it's your head on your shoulders. Topic in high school right now going through. Uh, I don't yeah. even, uh, no, not you don't want to talk. No, I'm, I'll talk about anything, but I don't have anything. Like, oh, let topic. me ask you a question. Ask me questions. Okay, question: How much drugs is in Mel High? Pretty good amount. Yeah, the re only reason I asked that is when I did a study years back. Mm -hmm. Mel High wasn't even, and, and it still is not even considered one of the top drug schools in the area. How many of those area. kids knew how easy it was to flip packs because of the internet? Uh, oh, yeah. listen, Almost every one listen, of them doing Nick, you knew how to yeah. tile. How many people <laughs> learn jobs? So don't go there again. <laughs> okay, okay but also, y'all were still selling drugs back in the day without social media. Oh, for right, sure. of course we I were. <laughs> My point, though, 
in in this area, we live. Everybody, we live in Central Florida well, a on pretty the coast. Good area too. A very good area, and in fact, Mel High is not even on a top seven in drugs in in the county. That's good. In it, it's yes, in Brevard. Satellite High was number one. Uh, Satellite v- Vieira High is is ahead of Melbourne. Yeah. No, it's but not when two. were these stats? Two thousand. These no, these are stats from about two thousand thirteen. Yeah, okay. What about a galley? We need to. Oh, galley was ahead of Melbourne, but but not. Okay, but these are two thousand thirteen. Thirteen. Listen, they're close. Do you know the number one on. drug school uh, uh, for cocaine? I, well, you don't Honestly. know anymore. Well, it, back in the day, okay. two thousand. It might have been fourteen. Whatever it was. About Florida schools. No, right here in this county. Oh. It was MCC. No shot. Yeah, and they used to call it. Uh, Melbourne cocaine capital instead of uh, Christian uh, so Central, uh, Central Catholic. Catholic. Central Catholic. It's those Catholic they have the money to buy. Yeah, they're all rich yeah. kids who got kicked out of the public school yeah. system, and their daddy's got them into the Catholic school, okay. and and they're still doing their crap. Uh, uh, listen, yeah, kids are going to be kids in every school. Gang schools was Coco Heritage. That's crazy. Heritage, you know Heritage, yeah, know. Coco. Uh, who? Pa, uh, no, Palm Bay wasn't bad. Palm Bay's a good school, actually. Really? Palm Bay, it's a magnet school, too. Do you know that? Ma- I mean, it's like a higher educate. They can get college classes there. They, Mel High, uh, Palm Bay's actually Melbourne a good school. Melbourne does the same thing. Yeah, yeah. I think Melbourne does. So Melbourne, they, these two are actually pretty good they're in the county. Schools. Yeah, they are. Uh, I mean, just because they're the money on the beach, yeah. that's where they get in trouble. Uh, Coco, obviously, got a lot of bad stuff going on up in Coco. Titusville has some bad stuff. Uh, Heritage out west, Palm Bay. Yeah. Had a lot of gang problems at one time. Now, again, have they cleaned it up? I haven't been in it as much as I have. But I do hear from young people, and that's why I like to ask young people yeah. what goes on in these schools. And not because, listen, I, I that's how I stay connected, because I listen to you. Because mm. you know more than me about that. Now, you don't know more than me about prison, <laughs> but you know more than me about what's going on in your schools. And I respect that, and I think just make good choices. It's going to be around you for the rest of your life. And you're going to do stuff, and no matter what you do, and everybody knows that I'm pro everything. Is you control it, don't let it control you. You With make that a good said, point. Parents good. need to do more of what you're doing, Larry, where you listen to your kids, watch what they're doing. That's how you're going to find out about listen, that. Stuff. You know, when I and you don't be a part of their lives, you're going to miss out on opportunities to figure out what's really going on. Paul, I had a whole system. I could talk about how you know, with parents, what to look with kids change, whether it's hairstyles, the way they talk, the way they they, they dress. Uh, just observing and then listening. I always brought myself down, so to speak, to a young person's level, their age, when I started this, because I respect them. I To this day, I respect his opinion as much as anybody's. Instead, and I, and I will never disrespect him, and I won't let him disrespect me. I mean, that's just a respect issue. Mm-hmm. But I'm not going to say I know more than him right now. Whatever he's, Whatever topic he's in school right now, you don't know more than him. Now, do you know more about life than him? Obviously, a ton more about life. And your specialty, whether it's accounting or whatever, you're going to know more. But you know we forgot more stuff in math and all the stuff yeah. than, we're, than these oh, kids know right now. And parents need to do that. Mm-hmm. That's a whole other conversation. That the is stuff they a teach conversation. anymore is not valuable, I feel yeah. like. Well, a lot of it is a waste. Yeah, and, you know, understand. that's why I'm not a believer in every kid has to go to college or something. 100 percent You know, now... Trade schools are fantastic. Trade schools are great. Uh, a lot of other things are, are pretty good to go to. And kids need to find out what it is, whether it's they, they want to be an entrepreneur. Mm-hmm. Did you know all your... Talk about the rich people who made it. Most of them dropped out. Elon Musk isn't, but... Uh, that's what Ma- I'm... Uh, Bill Gates, Jobs, they all yeah. quit college. Quit! Because they came up with an idea, they didn't want to waste the time on bullshit and let somebody else invent that shit. So you got to think about that as well. Right. Uh, Nick, do you have anything to say today? No. Well, oh. today or about today on on, on the show, whatever. No. Nothing. No. Wow. First what? time ever. Did I get kicked no. off? <laughs> I never I say anything co- at the end of the shows. So I'm no. always ready to Did wrap I get them up. Kicked off your football podcast because I'm winning too much. Is that why you? Guys oh, oh we're gonna talk about that. No, Paul. Paul's another winner. Paul, you've been hot. You're leading our pool. Way to go. You got to represent us down here in the Palm Bay crew. Did you see that text I sent I about the crew? <laughs> and you got to keep representing our crew over here. And we're doing. And I, all I gotta say is that thank you, thank James. You. And I had a lot of fun. I think we just got to the point where I think social media is positive. Period. End of story. Nick is wrong, and we'll go to that later. 
We'll go into that, and I'll, I you will. Just, and I want you guys just, to. You're just, yeah, you're just ignorant to some know, situations. No, I'm just doing this. <laughs> but I want he you knows, to listen to his he knows, show. He knows this much of the internet, and that's what he's going to make his argument about. I know this time. much. You know how much I know about the internet now? Not much. Dude. At least yeah. this much. Exactly. <laughs> A lot. You're lucky I came in and cultured you about, like, actually. No, you know. The internet, the no. culture of internet. What did you teach me about the internet? I cultured you Listen, on, I was doing the internet before YouTube. you were born. I cultured you on YouTube, buddy. Oh, now? See? No, I know yes, more. Yes, you did. I guess did I, I did. not teach you about the back end of YouTube and everything? Uh, it's not the culture of YouTube. You didn't even know there was, you didn't even know that there was, like, communities on YouTube. Mm-hmm. Communities that like beefed with each other or helped each other out. I don't still. I still don't okay. see like communities. Yeah, you just you do this, and every time we get off the podcast, you be like, "Did you like how good I argued with you?" <laughs> no, I don't. And then he goes, said. "Guys," and then he goes, "I really agreed with you on that point, but who? I just wanted to annoy You're you. You're such a liar. I just liar. wanted to annoy he you. Is so, now, look, he's doing this to just, annoy me now. I just wanted to annoy you. Listen, <laughs> I want anybody to come here and listen to some of his shit. He, he's, he's he's doing good. He's learning editing. He's doing a lot. He's uh, advanced so much from starting and not knowing crap and then learning from me about a lot of the business end of this and, and what it is. It's and not YouTube the culture. And the back end. And the, it's it's not, what see you how he takes culture? my thing and then he gets a whole new argument on top of it? I'm talking about culture. Not the what you, yeah, you tell me what you taught you me on culture. About, Larry, everything you watch on the internet now, I showed you. Every single thing. Everything that you watch and gather entertainment for your brain, I showed you. What? what you, like what? Let's T-Grizz- go through the T-Grizz- history. <laughs> T. Grizzly. He did. No, I like rap. I, I liked rap before yeah. he was born. Right. But that's not what you listen to right now. T. Grizzly. I do listen. Juice what World. do we listen to? Do we uh, listen to Eminem? Rough, rough and Rowdy. He don't Dave, like Eminem. Dave I like Fortnoy. Eminem. Fortnoy. See you how like Eminem. These, see how I'm just doing that. D. Fortnoy. All these podcasts we listen to now. You just bring him the like the more modern. He's br- yes, modern. there's I'll no question through, he has. I'll just, just go through the history. Things. That's all. I'll he just is. go through yeah. the and history. And I love to be culture. Love Thanks, guys. Culture. I love YouTube it's just culture. New. What's culture? YouTube culture. Listen, yeah. I also exposed <laughs> him to stuff. He never used to watch the police videos and the cop yeah, bad is, cop that video. That is totally false. Oh. I told you. I told you multiple times during COVID. I watched like at least seventy hours of like. Body languages from psychopaths and body cameras. It's just a pissing contest. So, you know what it is it now? Is. With him, it is. It's you wrong because he. I, I love to watch you ever, you did the First Amendment guys. You ever watch those on the show? Larry, you act like that's that's just now popular. That's been around forever. You know what it is? Dude. Yeah. Okay. Do you watch it? No. He didn't either. <laughs> yes, the fuck I did. Dude. First Amendment. You, the what? people who literally go around and poke the cops. Okay, to get do you charges? know what your First Amendment? Do you know your Second Amendment? I don't amendment? give a fuck about my oh, amendments. You don't. <laughs> I don't care. You want to start a law conversation? I you want to start a legal conversation? You go to jail. I do not care. <laughs> I don't you care. You don't all, want to start a legal a conversation joke. with me. All it is is a joke. What is a joke? All the amendments. You see what you see? Now, all now just he's a poking joke. fun because he knows it's about law. Just a joke. And he's just wanting to argue. And that's what he does. He does that on purpose. He's getting under there now. Yeah, he, eh, he's not getting under me. I, well, I, I, I make a lot of money on those amendments, so it can't be that big of a joke. Yeah. That's right. It's no joke, man. They went. All, <laughs> you damn right they went. All right, everybody. I think you got a great speech again. Thank you, James. Thank I really you. appreciate yeah. it, Paul. Thank, well, you. thank you. I will see you, buddy. Yeah. Nick, good job. Thank you, everybody. Please get out there. Enjoy what we do. Make good choices. Comment. I'll answer. This is the real deal with Larry Lawton.